Hey, it's Chime Time, and this is the last video of the day. And we're discussing holsters. And these are the cool, like, leather holsters that everyone's always asked me about. They're like, what are those? You know, like, you're, you know, is that part of your outfit? I know, they're actually totally usable, uh, and they're totally beautiful. They actually are part of the outfit, uh, every outfit, because I'm always having these on. Um, they're made by Andremi Designs, and he is, uh, him and his fiance Marley travel around mostly the East Coast. There's some other vendors. I think there's another guy named Santiago that makes something very similar, but on the West Coast. And they travel from festival to festival, different venues, uh, selling these things. Um, they may take purchases online. I'm not too sure. Uh, you could check out Andremi Designs, like Andre, his, his name's Andreas. And uh, so like type in Andre M.I. Design on Instagram, find them there. They do take requests. These colors I bought off the spot. I bought these at, this pair at summer camp. And then I bought this pair at Camp Bisco in Pennsylvania. So that's Illinois and Pennsylvania. And they do, you know, these were just on display. They were matching. It worked out really great for me, but they do take custom orders and I like to help them sell sometimes. <laughs> so you might even see me in their booth. Uh, again, I'll be visiting them at Halloween and that's so fire. So let me get right into explaining what they are and how they work. Uh, so yeah, like holsters are typically used for weapons, but I use these for my phone. So like the shoulder piece right here, uh, boom, cell phone comes out, you know, iPhone XR, not cool enough for the 11, not yet. Uh, and then it just fits. And then there's these magnetic uh, holes. Each piece typically has uh, one rare stone. This might be Labradite, not too sure. Uh, but the bottom one is turquoise, and I'll show you that in a second. Also, on the back of this is a trap pocket, and that's really good for storing secret items or things that you don't want people to find. So, like, if you're afraid of pickpockets, I keep my, uh, all my cards, my ID, and, uh, you know, uh, credit cards and things like that in here. And as you can see, I got my Metro card, all this stuff, it just pops out. Got a little switch. This is by Garter. Uh, it's RFID protected, so shout out to them. Uh, I don't make any money off this, but like, you know, marketing or whatever, but I do like Andreas a lot and I do like Marley a lot and they're great and they're great to me. So here is another one. Here's a zipper. In here, I keep my car keys or house keys because I don't really drive much anymore. Uh, and they're just dangle around in here. Uh, this was made by Vamp Up Design um, Life Balance, and I bought these in Thailand, so I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to find them, but I'm really into leather in general, as you can see, except for the RFID wallet. Uh, but yeah, this is leather, you just, you know, pull your keys up, make sure that they're uh, straight, push this down, and it stows right away. And you would not believe how easy this makes pulling things out of your pockets. Now, the, one of the reasons why I do rock these holsters is because I don't like keeping things in my pockets. When I'm dancing or when I'm walking uh, long distances, I live in New York City, um, it messes with my posture. You know, like it's the same thing. And this is like weighs down on your shoulders, but at least it keeps your posture nice and even. Uh, so then in the main cargo compartment over here, you know, you got another magnetic uh, latch and no, no trap in the back, but I keep uh, a little carrying case so nothing falls out. Uh, again, I got this in Thailand. It's like a little jewelry pouch, a little pencil case or something. And I keep uh, ginseng that I chew on and I keep earplugs. And I keep uh, one of these uh, Vix nose snuffer things because sometimes it smells really bad. 
you know, the person I'm standing around or if I'm going, I'm in line to the bathrooms, you know, I hold, hold one of those uh, so, that, so that I don't have to smell some junk. And also, um, it clears your sinuses. So like if you've been uh, just dancing in the rain and you're sniffly and you just want to get that stuff out, get one of those Vicks uh, Vapo tubes, one of those Vicks jobs. <laughs> so moving on. We got this pouch over here. Um, down here is like another uh, bag that you could put maybe your keys. A lot of people just rock one, not both. So um, I like to do three because I like to carry a lot of stuff. Sometimes I'll even have a backpack, but I like having the option of going light. And again, this is really good. Like I wear these on the airplanes, TSA does not care um at all you put them you put them on the conveyor belt with everything else they get scanned like everything else and uh these are considered clothing so when you get on the plane just more storage more room inside your personal bag and your uh carry-on um so again back to here is some really beautiful turquoise and it is actually formed within quartz so there's like quartz naturally embedded in here and you know it's just really really freaking beautiful this thing uh there's a a strap that goes around your thigh keeps it nice and tight to your body and they look really good now this one is you know like a bit tense you know uh, a bit extreme but i've been seeing a lot of girls here in new york city rocking these and they've been asking me where they're where they're from <laughs> and i'm like oh you, you gotta party more <laughs> so you can find them um you're doing a good job partying here but you gotta, you gotta party more uh and also there's plenty of storage it's weird because um the angle i have to stand for this video but bear with me while you look at my butt you know a little bit of uh you know, fan service uh there is one little pouch here which I like to shove my uh, plane tickets, you know, uh, whatever seat I'm in. Don't want, want to show my identity. Uh, and then you have this really big uh, pouch that, again, you could fit an entire phone in there or uh, tissues, whatever you need. A um, little bit of close-ups for the fine leather. Uh, so dope. You put whatever you want in here. Nice, nice close-ups. So sexy. No, oh, it really is though. And what's great about it is that the leather that touches your skin, if you're just wearing this on your skin, it's got that nice breathable texture and it's really comfortable, won't, won't irritate you. Um, the leather on the back of here is much like that. It's all really high build quality. Um, so I've had this one since Illinois and I, I've taken it to every single festival. I take it out, uh, dancing with me in New York city. Uh, it's held up all year long on so many flights. It's held up to so much abuse. Um, and the bottom one is just, you know, I've, I've had it for maybe half the year and it's, it's doing just as good. The things have gotten wet too. And you know, uh, even after getting wet and drying, it hasn't been a, a problem or anything of that nature. So again, shout out to uh, Andreas and Marley at Andremi Design. And uh, this is Chime Time. Hope you enjoy this one. This is the end of the day. I love you.